Hey Longhorn Nation, it's Dave O'Neill here, uh, head coach for Texas Rowing. And uh, I'm gonna do a couple short one minute clips or so about uh, rowing technique and, uh, and how to make the most of your rowing workout. Uh, some of you might have seen the rowing machine, the Concept 2 rowing ergometer in your, in your local gyms or at CrossFit. Uh, I know Crystal Conti and uh, Jared Elliott and Eddie Reese uh, use the rowing machine quite often. So uh, hopefully these uh, quick little videos be helpful. So the main thing about rowing is you wanna maximize the push with your legs, okay? It's a push to the legs, then an easy pull with the arms. So on the drive, push, then pull. Come back up, push, then pull. Strong push. Push, then pull. Push, then pull. On the recovery, when you're coming back up to the bend, arms first, then all the way up with the legs. Arms first, all the way up to the legs. Push, pull. Push, pull. Use your body. Just go from about 11 o'clock to 1 o'clock. Not a big swing with the body. Rock forward to 11 o'clock. Back to 1 o'clock. Okay? And it's always really important always horizontal. Okay, no up and down, go a long horizontal push, then the arm. Horizontal push, then the arm. Long push, pull. That's right. Okay, so my tip for everybody, if you're relatively new to the sport, the most common mistake people do is they just put it all the way up to level 10 for the on the fan setting. And when you do that, it's going to be like as if you're on the butt on a bike and putting on the biggest, heaviest gear possible. And if then it turns into it, it's going to be easy to feel the connection, but it turns into a maximum strength workout. And you can take maybe 10, 20 strokes like that before you're going to really tire out. My suggestion is to put it down around level four, level four, five, or six. Okay. So the resistance is going to be a little bit lighter, but if you have the stroke rate, the cadence a little bit higher, okay, you're going to be able to go for longer, and it's going to turn into a more of an aerobic workout, okay? So keep the stroke rate around 24, 26, 28 strokes a minute, and if you can, you can be crushing in your CrossFit workouts, be crushing at the gym. I got my workout in for the day. Thanks for tuning in. Hook them.